and waste the whole day. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> Is this nigga beatboxing that joint too, bro? Man, nigga. nigga, I'm sorry, nigga. I had to see that. I had to see that shit. You had to see that shit too. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, nigga. I wasn't gonna be the one that was gonna have to. <laughs> I can't get a fucking image out my head, nigga. I'm sorry. Y'all had to see that shit. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. Now on to regular scheduled programming. All right. Now let's get to what the fuck I was actually doing this video about. Nigga, I don't think I've seen this shit since it premiered. It's been like, what, 19 years? Probably 19, 18, uh, 19, 18 years. I saw this pop up on my feed. I said, you know what? I'm going to react to this. I was going to watch it anyway. Let's watch it together. Let's see if my memory comes together, if shit is, is like I remember it. Because I remember there's being fights every five minutes. Mega the Band 2, Season 2, Episode 1, Cheesecake. You should know what the fuck the Cheesecake episode mean, nigga. Shout out to Dave Chappelle. Got a special coming out. Probably today. Probably going to react to that. This weekend, when I got time to fucking think and shit, because you know how Dave Chappelle is. But let's get to it. Making the band season two, episode one. You should know two people in this motherfucker at least. I'm not gonna tell you who it is. You should know who it is. Let's get it. Barry, right, hold it there. MTV. Oh, this thing is ass. ass. I mean, this thing is being way better than that. That's no wonder. Why did the man not make it? Like, this is the, 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 the preview. I see what MTV. So we starting the mix process now, yo. This is Daddy's house, the home of the hits. It's called the Biggie. We got the Biggie room, cause he used to always work in here. You over there, you got the Diddy room. I'm gonna mix this record here, get this record finished to get, be on the Bad Boys 2 soundtrack. When you're launching a new group, you try to get them exposed in many other outlets. So this is like the start of the mixing process. Y'all seen them in the demo. Bad Boys 2, I think it's better than Bad Boys 1. You can hate me for that, but I think it is. Nigga, the, the car chase scene, nigga? Nigga, I was five hours long. It's the best shit ever in the world, nigga. The car chase scene with, 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 with Will and, no, it was, uh, what was it? Uh, Mark Lowry and motherfucking Marcus and shit. That was the best fucking shit ever. Better better than anything Fast and Furious ever did. I'm just gonna say. More process at the house. This is the real deal right here. Big boy. Is that my nigga? Stevie motherfucking J. See, we, we, we going back in time now. Stevie J before Jocelyn and all that love and hip hop and shit. Nigga, I'm not surprised. Nigga got an open U shirt, nigga. I ain't shy. <laughs> oh, shit. Right. Big boys. With a common hat. Like it's nice, but that's like, don't, 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 can't get Chappelle. I can't get Chappelle episode out of my fucking head, man. Oh my god. He said, I want you to get me by a Cambodian immigrant holding these balloons, holding these balloons. I can't get that fucking shit out of my head. We gotta react. I'm gonna react to that right after this, yo. I'm probably gonna get taken out. I gotta put it on my Patreon or something. But... Can I talk to you for a minute? And you're gonna be working with the new engineer. Okay. All right, right. Somebody will be here in 15 minutes. Bam! <laughs> it's a lady. We don't need no woman. What's wrong with a woman? I bet you she, she ain't gonna know what she's doing. She's gonna bypass a nigga sucking his tongue? Okay, all right. I don't remember Freddie being that way, but okay. Oh, come on. She ain't really gonna know what she be doing. Oh, yeah, show winner. 
Huh? Are you a male chauvinist? Huh? Are you a male chauvinist? What's that? Think men are better than women at stuff. Yeah. Chopper 19, yeah, he's a kid. You got to kind of treat him a little different because he still kind of got the mind frame of, of a kid sometimes. Hey, yo, pretty chick As soon as the cameras come on, it's like, it's the Chopper show. My good friend. Hey, yo. A lot of things Chopper do pisses me off a lot of times. At times, he can, he, can, he can really get on your nerves. <laughs> I love the boy, but he is on my nerves, like, real bad. Hello. What's that rap, man? She's asleep, yo. Hey, go wake her up. Wake her. Yo, she's asleep. Dog, go wake her up for me. Hold on, I'm like, you gotta tell Ben, What? What? Dumbass, young-ass boy, man. Hello? Uh, who was that, Chopper? Yeah. What be wrong with him, man? I don't know. That's why he want to crack his head for dumb that he be doing. Oh, uh, she sleep, yo. you. I ain't no boyfriend. What's wrong with him? You want me to get up? Yeah, where's your bath? All right. Hello? Yeah. All right. Make me come down there, boy. What's wrong? Chopper immediately hangs up. Chopper hung up on you for what? Yeah. He hung the bitch up, Sarah. Sarah? I'm just trying not to think about it, but it's like it's so hard when I keep getting confronted. But see, listen, you can't. That's what I'm saying. Me and John. That's what I'm saying. Is it like, okay, wait, first of all. Who is this? I know there's an issue with Chopper. Is it like, do you feel like there's like, you have issues with anyone else? Like, is it like a. Uh, this is the first episode. I feel like I'm missing shit. I really feel like I'm missing shit. Are you sure this is the first episode? Because they go right into it. Like, they don't even, like, go over no people's backstory or nothing. Like. You sure this is the first episode? Oh, you're going to roll with it. Fuck it. Is it just chopping to you? See, like. It's chopping and it be the mess that's the in this house. It's the the nasty. Then it's, like, constant fights. You, you know, know I have to keep on dealing with this mess, man. I'm not you. used to this. You have to okay. talk about it as a... Since they didn't do it, I'm going go real. Uh, it's not gonna make sense. I'm not, that's the only way to survive. And All right, this is the singer of the group. You know, the band. She's the singer, Sarah. I don't know what happened to her after this, but she's supposed to be like singer, the person do all the hooks and shit. All right, so that's that's Sarah right there. page, you're gonna feel like this. You need to relax and chill out. You just need to go home, Mama. You need to just a little break, get away, see your kids. That's this conversation say. about me. No, Chopper. Of course, by this point, it's Chopper. <laughs> The kid of the group, or uh, the wild child of the group, you know what I mean? I thought that nigga was gonna make it. I think that nigga should've been like Waka Flock before Waka Flock low key, but. What you really? What are you talking about? It's not about city. Chopper gotta be in control. Chopper gotta feel like he's tough. Why are you surprised? Nah. You think everybody here talks about you all day long? All the time. Really, no? She's mad. Well, can you give us a minute so we can finish talking? No, I cannot, Alley Cat. Thank I you. cannot give you a minute, but you know what? Give you a second. Thank you. He trying to be Mr. Big Shot. I just don't want to talk to him right now. Here we go. You ready? Yep. Feel so crazy. No, I was flat. The sensation, emotions. Do it again. Emotions, emotions. Stress doesn't do anything but kill your voice. Emotions, Ugh. emo. Just add some more to your voice. You know what I'm saying? Like a vibrato or. Just, just, just the attitude. Emotions got me into you. I'm um, the you little shot. Okay. Let's do it again. Mm. Well, I know you can do it better. Hey. Just cheat on a little. Vibrato is cheating. You, you know what I can get all the you, No feeling. You need vibrato in this joint. My voice is not working right now. I ain't even lying. My junk is jacked up, man. So what are we gonna do? I think we're gonna shut the studio down. <laughs> I think we're gonna shut the studio down, nigga. <laughs> if you don't know what this is, uh, you're not gonna get the references I'm fucking doing right now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hello. Hey, Tony. Hey, baby. Man, why don't you just send me a plane ticket? I want to come home. Why? 
I just can't take this shit, man. Okay, so uh, I'm just I'm, I'm not about to, I'm telling you, man. Just send me a plane ticket. I want to come. Hold on, Sarah, Sarah, baby, come on, talk to me, right? Come on. I'm out of here, man. I'm out of this funky. I don't remember fucking Sarah's uh, husband being Bishop Don Juan, nigga. <laughs> that nigga. Come on, baby, hold on. Just, <laughs> look at that. Don't mess with the money, man. <laughs> oh, baby, like you the you the. <laughs> You the branches on the root, like you just we gotta, we gotta make sure we flourish and, and bloom together. Nigga. Like nigga, I did not know that his I do not remember Sarah's husband being fucking bitch of Don Juan, nigga. That's just hilarious. Ass house, I'm hilarious. out of here. Listen. I don't give a f who's listening. I'm out of here. I know you venting. That's cool. He wants me to do the Beyonce vibrato. Man, I ain't Beyonce. When is the deadline? I'm out of here, man. Let me go. Bye. Can you talk Falls for a fucking Bentley. Holy shit! I didn't see that nigga in a minute. Once again, you, you should know. You should know. Get out for a second. He's basically uh, Diddy's assistant. I just was getting stressed. I don't know where the umbrella is, but uh, I had a really, really bad night. Have you been sleep? I can't sleep. Why can't you sleep? I don't know. I just can't. Like I lay in the bed and it's like I'll toss and turn the whole night. I'm just trying to make sure you straight first of all. Right, I'm all off. No, I'm off so key. I'm... You don't even sound what you like yourself right now. Everything first of all, I don't understand how you expect niggas to do a, 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 a album when they have to be around niggas all day that they didn't even rock with like that, like. Niggas that really do music, they at least are in a comfort space. You can't do music in an uncomfortable space. Like, that, that just shit never made sense to me. It's like, how am I supposed to do music in an uncomfortable space? Like, I swear to go to my spouse or whatever, my kids, then go to the studio. I should have to fucking stay here all night, all day, around, away from my family, and try to make music. That don't even make sense, but, hey, it's TV. <laughs> irritating the crap out of me. Robbie's sound like I'm about to punch a wall or something. I just want to be by myself. I just feeling crazy right now, that's all. No, we don't want you feeling crazy, though. If your throat is burnt out, then I'm not going to have your voice for Puff. <laughs> He's imitating somebody right now? Puff that. What I'm trying to say is... What I'm trying to say is... He's a good one right now. I don't know what that is. Mr. Bentley? Right now. Oh. Stop it, stop it. Stop it. Can I tell you about? <laughs> Can I just tell you to play that? Can I just tell you to play that? Play that. Sh I think that child's <laughs> immaturity is starting to get on the group's nerves and also my nerves. Play that. Do I tell you to play that? Hello. Yo, who you think is the most difficult? Okay, I don't like that. Uh, what's that rap, man? Yo, he's an asshole. Now, who you think is the most difficult producer to work with, like, all time? Like, you got Quincy, Diddy, Dre, Kanye. Um, I'm trying to think of, like, RZA, Jimmy Jam, <laughs> Terry Lewis, nigga. Who you think is the most difficult person to work with, man? Hey, I'm with Sarah. Oh, Tony, I really don't know. Um, you want me to check for you, Tony? <laughs> Is that what you want me to do, Tony? <laughs> Yo, what? Why did you tell my husband I wasn't here? I didn't know where you was at. You seen me on the bed chopper. Hey, Ben, is that Sarah? I didn't know where you was at. You did see me. You know it. Don't do that. Don't disrespect Don't do me like that. Man, disrespect Don't hang up on him. That's my husband. I told her on board. In a discussion. I don't know where you was at. In a discussion. I don't even know where you One minute, she laughing with your ass. Ah. Next minute, she mad at your ass. Basically, after all that we went through, I just want to get in a good mood and go into a little club and listen to some music. He does no couple studio drinks. time at all, nigga. Where you at, boy? You need to get out and see what everybody listening to in the club. Bad boy, baby! We are the bad, bad boy. Yeah. Bonesworth, they got pulled like that. <laughs> that nigga thought he had pulled. They got, they got pulled like that, nigga. <laughs> Enos look old, old enough for all them niggas. You made him say, oh, you you with them? Oh, yeah, you all can come in, nigga. You look old enough for all them niggas. <laughs> I'm just playing, yo. Shout out to Enos, yo. Shout out to Enos. 
Alex, you just know who Enes is. You know who Babs is. I'm trying to think who else on it. Freddie. He the, I don't know. I don't know where to dial on that Freddie at. Shot was kind of wilding out. Sometimes it makes me feel a little bit embarrassed because it's like he always got to act like an ass every everywhere we go. I don't want to hit. Dog, dog. He got us out here looking like fools because of. Oh, hold on. Let me rewind. Rewind real quick. Rewind. Okay, that's Freddie. Uh, I don't even know. I don't even know what his template is. He just a rapper, gutter. Mm. I guess you could say. And Dylan. Dylan is. I don't even know how to explain that. Like uh, you, you gotta let Dylan display Dylan. Like I don't even, I don't even, I don't even know how to explain Dylan. Like, like this explains Dylan low key. But uh, yeah, that's everybody. Dylan, Freddie, Chopper City, Babs, Enes, Sarah. I think that's everybody. Because of his mouth. What did you say? To, what did you say? To, I did not remember Chopper doing that. Come on, come on, come on, man. That's what I'm saying. Don't you have to give up. We I got other say, people thinking about you. Say the so we waited on you to come out here. Now you have a f***ing attitude? I just said I said that at all. All right, real, man. All right, all right. Don't that real fool say that, man. For real. So what the f*** are you doing then? Good. If you don't care about it, why you coming to attitude? I just said I'm towards that. I'm not selfish for it. Sometimes he could be very annoying. He's very childish. He needs to grow up. He was like, f*** it, this club, I'm bad, boy. No, I'm bad. I didn't say it in his last face. You ain't saying it in his face. You said it out loud that he heard you. I'm I ain't saying it out loud. I'm saying say it right here. Yes, he did. I, if I heard you, he uh, heard you. Know what? you. It's not it. Diddy. You uh, act like you Diddy. I don't act like I'm nobody. Yes, you did act okay. like you was Diddy. Well, then look. Yeah, you disrespect Everybody me. tells you you got to be humble. You do that sh to a lot of people. And y'all in the same group as me. We outside looking like Standing online longer than we had to because of your actions. It's always a problem. Yeah. Take like the we tired of this. We came together. We come together. You're supposed to lead again. Why you like pushing my button, Sarah? Why you like trying to take over something that you ain't got not a clue of what you're doing? You can't tell me Sarah's husband ain't bitching down wild, nigga. Listen to his conversation. I do not remember this. You can't tell me Sarah's husband was not Bishop Don Juan, nigga, respectfully. I don't mean y'all two together or whatever. You can't tell me that shit, nigga. You gotta take the bitter with the sweet, man. Quit being so soft, man. Listen to what he's... All that crying ain't gonna get it, baby. Suck that up. You can't tell me his... We're gonna start the next the records, and we're gonna start with one record today. Blaze the Got a problem, best to ease up. Ain't no fighting, I'm ready to hit ya. So, like, I would basically have a seat. I want y'all to come and watch, like, I guess the process of the mix. Well, uh, chill, enjoy the process. I saw them, big belly women, we saw them. Jews in the whole beat, bargain whenever they float, and better suck in your chain just to keep on walking. You're a thug, but you keep on talking instead of clacking. Get your girl stomped out of the. Look, what's wrong with you, man? Chicks like I'm Hercules. Huh? Come on. What's wrong with you? I'd rather talk about that, like, like privately. I'm alright. You talking to me about something? Oh, I'm just going through some stuff. I'm alright though. Let me have some time. Nigga, all the way every time. Let's go, man. Let's go, man. Let's go, man. I'm just tired of chopping. Oh my god. What chopping? What are you doing? Just driving me nuts, man. Like. When I get stressed like that, it feel like it's going to explode. Um, I got to just take a time out. When I'm out on the road for long periods of time, I definitely get lonely, definitely miss my family. You know, I have three sons, so I kind of relate to her. She has three kids. You don't think you're missing your husband or something having to do with it, too? I'm missing your, your kids? Yeah, it has a lot to do with it. I ain't going to even lie. I've been feeling like just leaving, like leaving my stuff up in there. And just busting, like running, just like leaving. Uh -huh. I can't leave because my heart is like, nope. You're staying here. You're singing. You're gonna do what you've been dreaming about. I wanna enjoy. I wanna enjoy this. It's becoming a burden, man. I don't think that there's nothing you gonna get out of life that you really want. That ain't gonna be so a level of pain involved. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna get worse, but it's also gonna get better than you could like ever imagine. You know what I'm saying? We definitely here for you. I'm here for you. All right? I'm gonna be all right. All right. 
gonna say I love you, child. I love you too, man. I just wanted to tell you that, all right? I love you, little brother. I'll be back. I just wanted to call to see how you were. I just wanted to see what you were doing. You might not think I understand, but you know, you forgot one thing. You can't tell me his husband ain't bitch you No, y'all Tony. Sometimes you really don't understand, though. When I'm st and I'm up in this house and you're not here, sometimes you don't know the whole thing. Just He asked me, he was like, do you want to go home? If I was to go home for a couple days or whatever and come back at least for two hours, I wouldn't care. I'd be happy, but I can't do that right now. <laughs> Yo, I was about to say something. Wow. Yo, let me get some comical visuals or something. Nigga, like, oh man, go ahead. Oh I hear this in a minute. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. go back to that. I hear this in a minute. Hold on. I'd be happy, but on, I can't on. do that right now. Oh my god. I heard this is so low. I'm sleeping. Oh, that's fine. And next thing you know, all I heard was that's fine. All these that's little fire. footsteps. I'm like, am I dreaming? That sounds familiar. You know, because it usually happens all the time in my house. <laughs> so I kind of open my eyes up a little bit and I see a little, the cutest little faces I've ever seen in my whole life come through my door. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I needed this straight up. I'm dreaming, right? So I feel complete. I feel fulfilled. We just get funny guys. That's what I'm saying. Like, I was saying. In that room right down there. <laughs> see, can we see Chopper? That's hilarious. <laughs> get him, Ryzen. Yeah. Oh, kids cool with me. Me and kids is like this, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm still a kid. You know what I'm <laughs> I like Chopper a lot, but I feel he has a lot of growing up to do. But when you're dealing with investing over seven figures in terms of Francis, Francis. Ah, oh, I'm just about to say that had to be Houston, uh, Rockets. Uh, Steve Francis and um, Steve Francis was a cold motherfucker. Steve Francis was a cold, but he was a cold. He was cold, boy. He was cold. Him and uh, Catino Mobley. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Woo! Bring my memories, boy. You want to make sure that the immaturity is not going to mess Steve up Francis the chances. Steve Francis with Katina Mobley. Success. I think that was before uh, Trish McGrady got to me. This thing that you're getting into right here, you've heard it from me before. Like, this is my life. This is what I do. This is what I love to do. Number two is, it's a lot of money involved. You don't want to buy with your money. You wouldn't want that, right? No. You got you to gotta pull back on some of the stuff. Like, your lack of humility may be your downfall. I love a confident swagger. Yeah. I love a little bit of cockiness. I don't like a lot of it. Too much of it, it's gonna turn me off. It's gonna turn the fans off. And it's gonna f up our success, our money. And we can't have that. I feel every man has to grow his own way, but if somebody that's a little bit older, you know what I'm saying, could tell him like, yo, there was times where, you know, it was a situation where, where, where to be honest, that, that could have been my downfall. Just being, having too much of an ego, getting caught up. Don't get caught up. We about to go to another level. You know what I'm saying? You're a major part of the team. But it's like, I'm not going to let you be my headache. You know what I'm saying? You ain't going to be the one causing me stress. Don't get on my nerves. And don't push me. Don't hit me with no bull Don't do that to me. Because I don't want that in my life. Don't f*** this up. I mean, he right. You know what I'm saying? He right. right. Sometimes I just play with his really tired of work. All right. Thank you. All right. He really right. Now have the group come in, re-record vocals for tonight. It's a song they have on their album. I wanted to spend some quality time with them on their vocals here at the studio and being able to perfect it a little bit more. You know how nervous I'd be right now, nigga? Like, I would, I would have a nervous breakdown, nigga. Like, I'm in a studio with fucking Diddy in 02. I would have a nervous breakdown. Man. That is a possible first single. So we're going to do all the vocals over. We're going to do the mix tonight. So I'm going to send you all in one by one. Who's first up? Let's go, Babs. You wait looking Come on, Babs. Bad. Let's go, Babs. Yeah. Give it up for the ladies. <laughs> Let's go, Babs. Yeah. How right, let's go. Yeah, baby, tonight's the night. I'ma ride that thing like a motorbike. Yo, Dylan, you ready, man? 
Dylan's ready. <laughs> Dylan, let's go. Have you in the kitchen, put them on the dresser, show you in the closet, then undress you. It's the night, it's the night, they get Bucky Ball neck and they make love all night. This sounds like shit. Thank you. I appreciate it. Do it one more time. All right. All right. <laughs> what was that Scooby Doo sound? <laughs> let him know I'm on the track. Who was that? Let me hear that again. <laughs> Leave that up off for this one till we perfect it. All right. I'm gonna hold you. I thought Freddie was gonna make it out of all these niggas. I don't know why. I thought that shit. I said, Freddy probably don't want to go make out all these niggas. I don't know why I thought that shit. But he's like, oh, no, he just got a calm, I don't know, he got a calm swag about him. Come on, Sarah. Let's go, Sarah. Kill this hook, nigga. Let's go, Sarah. <laughs> It came out hot. I felt creative. I felt good, and it came together. I'll be a man with jaded, and it came out bitch hot. It's not easy keeping a six-person group together, but as you can see, when they work together, when they work as a team, great things happen. Six, six, six people too many. There's no reason that groups have more than four people, unless you're the Jackson Five. Or the temptation, nah, temptations didn't work out after they started. So. Unless you're the temptations or Jackson 5, there's no reason you have more than four people in the group. I'm sorry. It just ain't gonna work out. Through this journey together and through respecting one another, respecting the dream, and working hard together, each and every one of their dreams can be achieved. That's the end of the episode. No, it is another episode. Next, on making the band. Dylan is here, my A. Where's Dylan at? Where's he at? Music industry terms. I'm always serious. Oh, God. He's f***ing up the money. It's because of you. Everybody's against me. His days is numbered. Dylan, Dylan. Dylan, Dylan, Dylan. Because I spit hot fire. Oh, they just redid it. Okay. Well, that was episode one. Mega the band. Did his group. The band. I still don't feel like this cheesecake. This definitely wasn't season episode one. So this is probably like episode two or something like that. I'm wondering why I just it didn't feel like a episode one. But don't matter. It's probably episode two. I gotta look it up on IMDb and I post it. But fuck it. You don't need to know the context of everything that's going on, nigga. All you gotta know is it's Diddy baby, bad boy. Ah 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 ah. Better hold it down. Be out, nigga. Ah. Thank you.